Good morning, everyone. Good morning. Uh, before we begin, I'd like to thank you all for coming. It's, it's great to see the many people came today. Uh, we have the national directors. We have people from the Friends of the Orphans, uh, people from Europe. We have former pequeños, former volunteers, volunteers. We have children from from the homes from MPH Baby. Uh, and it's so great to see you all together as a family. Um, that's what Father Watson would want. Uh, just one small uh, short story about Father Watson. And uh, before he passed away, we, some of us, visited him um, in Catmont. And um, we took him for a walk. And, and we asked him, you know, Father, what, what are your final words? What, what's, your, what's your message for us? Um, and he said, permanezcan juntos, because you know, that we, we ask him in Spanish. So, permanezcan juntos, be together, be united as a family. And, and I'm glad that, that we're coming together as a family. Uh, and we're working really hard to, to, to be together and not have uh, um, different agendas. Uh, and the, the, the best agenda is to take care of the children, all of us as a family. Um, just last week, we had a meeting. Uh, the Department of Family Services, Medical Services, and Finances uh, had a meeting with the National Directors. It was um, a difficult week because we had to deal, deal with issues, uh, child care issues, medical issues, and finances, uh, kind of a necessary evil, um, finances. But, um, but we, we were able to, to manage, and now we're here to celebrate the life of Father Watson and, and the vision of Father Watson. Um, and I'd like to introduce to you, uh, because some of you know, but uh, some of you don't, uh, the people who are making this possible, who work day and night, every day, for the benefit of the children. So I'd like to introduce you to the national directors. Will you please stand? Thank you. Thank you. If you remain stand, because I really want to introduce you. Karen. Karen is a former volunteer. He's from Ireland and he's the national director for the DR. <coughs> Olegario Campos is a former pequeño in, from Mexico and is working uh, as the national director for El Salvador. He graduated from Father Watson University. <laughs> <laughs> Alfredo Hernandez is a, he's a, a former pequeño from Mexico and working as the national director for MBA Peru. Stefan Feuerstein is working, he is a former volunteer and working as the national director for APH Honduras. We have Marlon Velasquez, it's a, he's a former volunteer, I mean former volunteer, he's a, he's a former pequeño or hermano mayor for, uh, from Honduras and he's working as a national director in Nicaragua. Jose Luis Guzman, a former pequeño in Mexico, from Mexico, is working as a national director for MPH Bolivia. Uh, Rafael Bermudez is a uh, former pequeño from Mexico and working as a national director in Mexico. And uh, John Lyrics is a former volunteer. He's working as a national director for MPH Guatemala. Um, and we have Father Rick, sorry. <laughs> Father Rick as, as a national director for MPH Haiti. And Agusnel, who's, where is Agusnel? Agusnel is the Father Rick's assistant, and he's a future national director for MPA Haiti. And, and Wynn is also my assistant, and so is <coughs> Robin. So would you please oh, stand Robin. up because it's wow. our Robin. Robin. team. And I'd like to introduce Reinhard Kuller. He's a former volunteer, and he's the director of uh, family services for MDH International, and he makes sure that we have, we give the best childcare possible to all of our children. Roger Cooler, and we have Pilar Silverman. He's our uh, she's our um, 
medical director, and she makes sure that we give the best care to our children um, at all the MPH homes. So please give them uh, a round of applause. Out of the nine national directors, six of them were appointed by Father Watson when he was alive. Three of them were not appointed by Father Watson, but were appointed by um, the executive committee of MPH International. And uh, in the future, we're going to have uh, pequeños who probably are not going to have not met Father Watson, but we are in charge. We're responsible to pass the spirit of Father Watson on to the children so that they continue the work that Father Watson what has been doing or has been doing um, for so many years. So um, Father Watson's are very big. Father Watson's shoes are very big. And <laughs> no one, no one is going to be able to fill them. But uh, however, we, we want to make sure that we pass spirit on to the children. And, uh, and here we are. And I think that uh, this is a very good day to reflect on the, on the life, the passion, and the vision of Father Wasson. Thank you.